y'all and welcome to another the freaking video okay so this is gonna be the start of you know it's gonna be like a week vlog so it's gonna be from i think sunday february 6th to like i ain't gonna lie i don't know but it's gonna be it's gonna be a week it's gonna be from sunday to i i'm gonna cut it off probably on friday and edit it that night and then i'm gonna post it for y'all that sunday so i'm just doing the intro for the video because your girl you know what i'm saying i kind of forgot to do it but anyway welcome to the vloggy vlog let's get into it we just got back from the msc and now we are about to go grocery shopping come along with me this is Yasmin. This is this is this is Yasmin. I'm on the way to HEB. Do grocery shopping with gang. Alright y'all, so I just got back from the grocery store. Let me show you. I'm just going to the water. And I got all my little groceries and stuff right here. So I'm about to put those up and then I'm about to, you know, do a little house cleaning too. Because it's Sunday. I'm clean on Sunday. So I just got done cleaning up my room, get into it all clean, all clean, all packed, got the candle going, bathroom clean, everything is clean, don't we love it, we love a clean room. So now, I think I'm just going to separate my laundry and go do some laundry. Yeah. Should we be nosy, see what they got going on? Hmm. I'm on my business, but let me let me go ahead and get to that laundry. Yeah. Boom. <laughs> Done. So Sorted. Good. Get into it. it. Took me like three minutes. One night for it. Okay. But so I got let my phone charge before I go to the laundry <laughs> mat. Because who's gonna sit up in there with a dead phone? Not me, because we go out of the Not her. I think I'm gonna sit in the pretty for a second. Okay, Alright, y'all. My little break was a little bit longer than I expected, but we're on the way to that good old laundry room. So, come on, let's go. Uh-oh. 
Oh my god. Okay. We're not gonna talk about the fact that I forgot to update y'all, but it's okay. Um, it's about 12 o'clock, meaning Sunday vlog is about to be over. Right now, I'm just really watching um, this documentary. Ooh, I can't see my finger. This documentary on HBO about it follows like three drug addicts over like 36 years. This is from 1984 to 2020. Anyway, it was really good. Y'all should watch it. It's called Life of Crime on HBO. But I'm gonna wrap it up and I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow on Monday. Y'all, hey happy Tuesday. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I am not on my top 10. I'm not feeling my best today, but that's okay because we are just going to take today and you know get back into it. But anyways, I just want to say happy Monday. And I'm about to finish my Chick-fil-A, lay down for a little bit, do some work, and then go to the gym. So, I just got back from the gym. I forgot to record as I was, you know, getting ready to go. But it was leg day, so I'm dead body right now. Like, for real. Legs barely holding me up. Upstairs. But anyway, I had a good workout. It really, you know, kind of made me feel a little better. Workouts always kind of mentally make me just feel better in general. But yeah, I'm about to take a shower, get ready for class. Because I have a class at 5 o'clock. 5 to 7 50 but she ain't gonna have us for that long she ain't gonna have us for that long but anyway day one of this weekend hey y'all monday workout okay hey y'all i'm gonna take y'all we're gonna have a little ted talk a little bit or something while i do my lash not my lashes my edges i was just wanting to say how you know i'm really appreciative of the fact that i can use the gym to really take me out of down like mental mental places because like earlier today i was really down right you know what i'm saying and that's whatever whatever everybody goes through their own stuff you know nobody's problems are really worse or above the next person but one thing that i do you know really love is that for me whenever i go to the gym it can um it literally can take me out of any down mental mental state anytime because it's just something that motivates me in a type of way so it's the fact that it stopped recording for me anyway to continue i was just saying that we all need to really be okay with you know feeling our emotions because i know a lot of people don't really deal with their emotions because i do the same thing i kind of let everything build up so when something does make me upset it kind of just hits me 10 times harder and everything just you know kind of like 
wash shoes like i gotta do everything that i just set up there and built up but you know one thing that i do do is a rule for me if i'm upset i'm gonna be upset i'm gonna let myself be upset for that one day but at the end of the day i'm not about to be upset with that that same thing tomorrow it's no point in sending my emotions and like dwelling in something that i can't change you got the time to be upset about it but the next day get up and do something and change or get up and do something and just not sit up there and be in your feelings because at the end of the day you can't change anything all you can do is be better as a person to sum it up boss up period period okay just get it together no i'm playing just get up and just be positive like everybody needs to find something that is positive like is a positive outlet for them that affects them positively you know what i'm saying like everybody needs that one thing because i feel like that one thing can really be there for you when nothing else is you know if you don't want to talk about it you could go to that you know what i'm saying so i think at the end of the day you know if you're upset it's okay deal with that emotion and don't compartmentalize that because that is not healthy for you at all but anyway y'all that was my little ted talk now it's time to get up out these feelings that i've been in all day child Y'all see the edges, y'all see the edges. One thing about me, one thing about Tristan, is she gonna swoop through the edges, okay? She gonna swoop through the edges. But anyways, yeah, I really just wanted to get that out there, you know, put a positive thing out there because I know for me personally, I do not like to put my personal business or anything that I'm going through out on social media, but I do know that it is people out there that don't have people to talk to or, you know, are going through the same things and just aren't saying nothing. So, just for the people, if you're going through it, you know, I hope that this is a positive thing for you. You know what I'm saying? You know, but all love, all love to y'all, for real. Alright, y'all, I just got back from class not too long ago. I was really downstairs chopping up in the office, but we're not going to talk about that. Anyway, I was in class. It's, it's just one class. We got a one day a week from 5 to 7. Tell me why she was late for one, for two. She it was like 5:20 until she even thought about attendance, and then she was really going through it. This thing was stressing. She had a lot of stories. She was telling stories. A car was smoking. The locked keys in in the car, all of that, and then the computer was starting up. So this thing, this thing, let us go. You know, thank God. Um, I'm about to go to the store because your girl went to the grocery store on what Sunday yesterday. And didn't even get no frozen food or nothing. So now I gotta go redo it. And I gotta get a charger. Cause this broken charger that I got don't even work no more. Like, Alright y'all, I just got back from my little grocery run. They didn't have shit. Walmart didn't have nothing. Either Dollar General's didn't have nothing. It was a waste of time, but it's okay. It's my team. I got it, y'all. I got some AirPods, right? I got the AirPod Pros. If these go dead like the other ones, I'm going back to wise because I don't want through three pairs of AirPods. I'm not doing it again. But let me tell you something. One thing, one thing about PV is they not gonna have parking. They not gonna have parking. I I drove for ten minutes straight to find a parking spot, and I'm not even in my lap. But I don't care. Hmm. Hmm. I don't care how long it takes to get out. finally in her bed okay finally in her bed it is 125 so 130 so really 2 o'clock is what i'm talking about anyway so 
I'm about to go to sleep. It was, you know, it was an alright day or whatever, but tomorrow is going to be better. And yeah, watching the crowd family. We go to sleep to her. Yeah, she had us a bad, that's a one bad bitty right there. Y'all could never. I'm going to see y'all tomorrow.